Hello and welcome to Elstree Studios in Hertfordshire, the home of EastEnders. Here for 25 years, Den and Ange have had angry sex. Janine Butcher has briefly become Jewish and Tiffany fell and died under the wheels of a taxi. And to celebrate the 25th anniversary, The Guardian has been invited in just for one day. So here I am, except I have an evil master plan. It's not enough for me just to go and watch EastEnders. No, I want to be in it. I want to be an evil middle-class dentist called Tanya Gold, Dr. Tanya Gold, who will kill all the cast and own the Queen Vic for herself. <laughs> Dr. Tanya? Uh, hi, Masood. Hi. I've How's got... your tooth? Yeah, I've got a bit of a problem with it. I wonder if you could sort it out. Um, yeah, sure. Um, what I'll do is I'll put you in the chair and then I'll suck all the pus out your gums. Oh, oh, oh. I can do quite a good East End accent. I could Go be on. a genuine East End. You're having a bubble. You, if you think I've got, I've got an appointment at four o'clock today, you're having a bubble. I'm busy, ain't I? The Guardian. Spreadable butter. One thing I've always wondered is when EastEnders stars are on the front of newspapers, do they hide the newspapers that are for sale in the minute mark? Which side of your mouth? <laughs> and does it hurt very badly? <laughs> Are you registered with the NHS or are you a private patient, Mr. No, i NHS. I'm too tight to go private. I'll, I'll see you in six weeks then. Please, can I have a cup of tea? I'm the evil middle class dentist, Dr. Tanya Gold. Do you remember when Pat finally told uh, Frank to go away and Frank drove off in the middle of the night and Pat changed her mind and ran into the square and screamed, Frank, why, as my sister pointed out at the time, didn't she just call him on his mobile to say she changed her mind? Because back then it was really expensive to call mobiles. So tragic because Pat and Frank, they belong together. Yeah, but you could say that about a lot of them. Ian and Cindy, Den and Angie. You're having a bubble, ain't you? You're having a bubble? You're having a bubble, ain't you? Bubble bath laugh. Whatever they want him to do, happy, sad, pathos, guilt, you name, name the emotion, they can find some way of justifying it. Pathos. <laughs> Guilt. Same look. I killed Ian Beale! I killed Ian Beale! I killed Ian Beale! I've just stolen a barley sugar from the East Enders stall. And now I'm going over to try and, uh, try and get a, a lemon sherbet. Would you like a poison sweet? Lovely, thank you. You're very welcome. Is this your sort of like dentistry? This is your catch? Yeah, yeah. So Once you've... sweets are bad for you. Darren, I have something to tell you. Go on in. I know that I'm 36 and we come from different worlds. I'm from Isha, you're from... North London. North London. Um, but I think that I'm in love with you. Oh, it's I your know. beautiful green eyes and your lovely red jacket. Insane women are often the best lovers. Yeah, it's true, but I mean, I, I, I wouldn't want us, you know, Look having at Angie. a nice. I oh, know, I wouldn't want us having a nice dinner and to find out, you know, you've you've cooked one of my friends. I could go into therapy. I could get better. You need to go into therapy. Uh, why not? Uh, hey, they look all right. They, yep. Yeah. They look all right. I yes. think that you um, you don't need any major dental work. I think you should just come in for a checkup. Yeah, cool. So um, why don't you come in uh, next Tuesday for a checkup and and I'll. Kill you. And so, at the end of my first and only day on the set of EastEnders, my evil plan has been a success. Not only have I, in the guise of evil dentist Dr Tanya Gold, murdered everyone on the square, but now, by default, I own the Queen Vic. <laughs>